All right, now watch this, guys. This is the new Summon Park feature. Watch me get out of my car right here, and I'm gonna go straight into my house. And this is the first time I've ever used this. I recorded it the first try. I have never tried this before, so I'm really trusting that this is gonna work. I walk into my front door, and look at that. My car goes and parks itself. Look at this, it's so crazy. I'm actually sitting in my living room right now, crossing my fingers. Now let's take a look at this from the front. You can see here that when I start to, the car starts to pull in, that the wheels kind of correct itself back and forth. It's trying to find center, which is just super cool. And it works itself right in, no problem at all. And now let's take a look at this again here. So this is my second run at this. I close my door once again, I walk straight into my house, okay? And I walk in there and my car starts doing its own thing. I'm not even watching. I mean, this is how cool this feature actually is here. It finds itself nice and centered. You can see it pulling itself straight into the garage. It does tend to veer a tad bit to the right, but it really isn't too bad and gets it nice in there. And if I had the home link feature just to shut the garage after, it would have done all on its own. Now let's take a look from the front again. This time I'm out of my GoPro a lot higher and watch this come all the way in. Now I have my settings set to be really tight and to go about eight inches from the object in front. Now you can see it pulling in nice and centered, no risk of it going anywhere else. Look how well that pulls all the way in there. All right, well now that you've seen this, let me show you what it looks like from inside the car. So you're pulling into the driveway just like this. You say, well, man, I'm not gonna be able to get out of my car very easily if I pull in the garage. You just kind of stop here, okay? You put it in park, take your foot off the brake. Your foot needs to be off the brake. And then you press the park button twice and the deal pops up here and it says to go forward or backwards depending if you backed in or drive into your garage. And then all you have to do is press the up arrow. And when I get out of my car and close it, it's gonna go straight into the garage. And now watch, as soon as I close my door, the mirrors are gonna fold down, the tires are gonna start to go, and watch this. It's gonna pull in all the way by itself. And it does tend to veer a little bit to the right, you'll see here. Not too bad, but it definitely does. Then it corrects itself there. You can see the tire correcting itself. And there you go. So this time I took it back to the end of my driveway, probably 30 feet from my garage. So what just happened there was I exceeded the length that I have my car set to that it can actually be summoned. So you can adjust that inside, but it actually worked really, really well. I mean, how cool is that guys? The first time I actually did this, I was I just let it go all the way into the garage the first try. You guys are actually watching it on the recording each time I have ever done this. I haven't done this one time that wasn't recorded in the order you just saw it. So it's pretty trusting the first time to just let it go in front of my garage and just let it go right in. But I was so excited to finally get my update that I said, I'm just gonna let her go. And it worked just as advertised. Thanks for watching another one of my videos. It would help me out so much if you would take a second and go down and hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. I wanted to take a quick second now and thank my Patreons for all your support. We are just getting started. Now we all like to buy awesome new accessories to protect our Model 3 and just make it that much cooler. So take a second and check out our amazing sponsors here offering you guys killer discounts right here on this channel. My goal is to every week do a rate this drive, do some kind of a Tesla vlog type video, and then more multiple times a month on Fridays, do a review, unboxing, and a giveaway for you guys right here on this channel. You have x Technor offering you a 15% discount on products like windshield wipers and air cabin filters. You have the Rideshare Shop offering you a 10% discount on A through Z, anything for your Model 3, on products like power lift gates for your trunk to USB hubs and so much more. And lastly, you have EV Armor who champions protecting all those services in your car with amazing wraps like center console wraps to charging port wraps. And they also offer you guys, my subscribers, a 10% discount. To get those discount codes, just go down below in the description. You'll see their links, you'll see my code. Go to their website, enter my code in, you get to save money. Everybody wins. Don't pay more than you have to, guys. All right, I love you all. See you on the next one.